You know, IT server people have been at kind of the top of the IT food chain for a long time. But quietly underneath the covers are our desktop IT professionals. And these are the people who work with things like terminal services and configuration manager. Well, these guys and gals have figured out how to automate installation of applications to desktops everywhere, and they've been doing it for years. Well, in VMM 2012, when you start moving to virtual machines on top of Hyper-V, there's this new technology called Server App V. There's also a new technology called Web Deployment as well. And what these two technologies in combination allow you to do is automate application installation just like the desktop people do. Hmm, maybe we can learn a, th a few things from them. In my recent 70-247 series from CBT Nuggets, I talk about how a lot of the tricks that people learned in Config Manager can work their way now into VMM. Here's a quick micro nugget that'll show you how it works. Okay, we have a completely different version of the package. And this package supports these settings, which are now extensible. So there it is. Well, what I want to do at this point is copy this package directly over to my VMM server to that application packages location that I was talking about beforehand. There's the V2. And with it in place, let me go back to our client. With it in place, I can refresh this location. And after a second or two, I should see the V2 package actually appear. Now let's go ahead and create a profile now. With this profile, there's my Java JRE uh, 1.7 v2. I want to make it available for everyone. I want to add it in as a virtual application. Uh, give it a name again. Set up the package a second time. And then lo and behold, check it out. There are those settings. And now if I want, I can change the setting maybe from a 1 to a 0, because in this particular deployment, I'm interested in not having it deploy out in that way. And so now I can create multiple application profiles that are defined by the configuration settings that I put in, lay into place. Awesome, 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 awesome. So there is the profile. As I said, that's the second half of packaging these applications. You've got to get at the profile because this wrapper content, the, uh, you know, back to the thing that I was drawing actually in that last nugget here, I have you know, the application itself, and then wrapping around it is the profile because that profile contains the additional information that installs that app appropriately. This me makes it very extensible. Want to learn more? Check out cptnuggets.com.